ตอนนี้ฟัดเยอะจังเอ่อซายเนี่ยเนาะเอ่อคอนเวนชั่นแนลไรท์ออฟเชิลดรันโนคอเรดิคลีตุงเนี่ยอคุยซาจุปอมา
state actor need to do more about this particular issue in terms of budgeting for for uh, terrain development issues? Well, what UNICEF is um, is doing now uh, over the last two years, we we cooperated with the Ministry of Finance. We cooperated also with the uh, Myanmar Development Research Institute to try to get a better sense of. Um, what is a budget uh, has been going for children over the last four years. Uh, and we, we, we're going actually to, uh, to present and discuss a report that we're launching uh, uh, exactly on, on, on the day of the convention, of the celebration of the Convention of the Rights of the Child. Uh, and we're going to involve also the parliamentarians, Myanmar parliamentarians, who have a key role to play. Uh, as we know, parliamentarians discuss uh, legislation, but also they discuss uh, budgets. So we're going to discuss with them the finding of this report. We show that indeed we saw an increase over the last years in the budget for health, for, uh, for education. But we saw a decrease in the budget for social welfare, for social protection. Uh, and we have to see how we can increase that budget to make sure that actually uh, children can benefit from the new resources available to the country. It's a, it's a key issue for child rights because you need to make sure that uh, every child in the country has their right uh, to development, to grow to their uh, optimal potential met. Uh, and this goes by, um, uh, by responsibility of the state to mobilize all its available resources uh, to prioritize children. Uh, so this is an important aspect, but we, we can also see that because of the new resources available to the country, we can increase the size of the budget uh, for, uh, for children. So it's not something which, uh, sometimes in some countries, it's very difficult to increase the budget for the social sector, which is a key sector for, uh, for children. Here in Myanmar, we see a, a growing, uh, growing revenues, uh, revenues coming from uh, new investment in the country, uh, generated by the economic growth, uh, so these revenues, and this is a UNICEF position, is that these revenues need to be channeled um, for children uh, because this is also the way you build the human capital in the country. Uh, if we want to see uh, an economy um, which is largely based now on its natural resources, and we know that the price of natural resources fluctuates a lot, so puts a country at a certain level of vulnerability, to external shocks. If you want to change the base of this economy towards a human capital-based economy, we need to start right now and we need to start with children F from early childhood development programs all the way up to uh, when they reach the age of 18, completing a quality education and being also protected and informed about the, the choices they have to make in their lives.